I mean, what do I know? I'm, I'm in my 40s. I don't, I don't care. I don't care. I don't care about anything, to be honest with you. It's nice. You get into your 40s, you just let go, which is a good, it's a good feeling. You know, young people care too much about what other people think. I, I, I didn't even really care if this show went well, to be honest with you. Like, I think sometimes I enjoy it more when it doesn't. I'm like, ah, oh, at least it was quiet. That was peaceful. Like, what a peaceful crowd. It's nothing like peace and quiet the older you get. It's the best. Oh, when you're young, you need things to be lit all the time. Quiet kind of like used to depress me when I was young. I remember when I was young and I would go into a diner and see like a really old couple sitting there in silence. You ever go into a diner and just see that old couple just kind of... <laughs> kind of sitting there and they kind of... <laughs> sitting however scoliosis will allow them to sit. <laughs> looking up at each other every four days. <laughs> That used to depress me till I realized that couple's having the best fucking time of their lives. Diners are nightclubs for elderly people. That's a hot night out for Nana. Do I want another cup of coffee? You're goddamn right I want another cup of coffee. You might be in here for 16 hours straight, sweetheart. I didn't put on these corduroys and sweater with moth holes for nothing. I do not know what old people did to moths. But they are out for revenge. Why do they only attack old people? You go over to your grandparents' house, it smells like a nuclear reactor. There's mothballs everywhere. You open the refrigerator, there's a mothball and the turkey sandwich. They're in drawers. She's wearing them as earrings. Have you ever worried about the well-being of your clothing, ever? Have you ever worried about moths eating your clothes? Have you ever gone out late at night, left a new sweater out by accident? It hit you, you remembered, and you ruined your night, you're like, oh, fuck. Oh. God, when I get home, that thing's gonna be Swiss cheese, you know? I think old people are making it up, dude. I don't think there's moths eating their clothes. I think this is just a plot by old people to get attention. They're lonely. They want their kids to call them more. They want their grandchildren to acknowledge them. And they made this whole thing up, that there's moths attacking their attire, you know? I'm supposed to believe that a moth doesn't eat my clothes until I get my first social security check and then somehow it knows I'm a senior citizen. And that's when I open the closet and they just fly out like bats out of hell. And what insect do you know that can survive off of human clothes? Is there any living thing that can eat an old navy sweater to live? <laughs> Have you ever seen a moth eating clothes? I've never seen it. The only thing I've seen a moth ever do is fly into a light and die like a Japanese kamikaze pilot, <laughs> making the emperor proud. I've never seen one just nom, 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 nom on my jeans. We'll call you Nana. Stop making up the dumb story about moths. <laughs> <laughs>